Hello Sagittarius, it's Milady from Milady's Way Tarot and I'm coming to do your weekly love reading. Get out of here. Somebody, wow, okay, so somebody wants you thinking about letting go. you just like, okay, whatever happens, happens, I just don't care, you know, and that somebody is leaving you, okay, could be the other way around. And then you just like, whatever, whatever. All right, so what's the lady from my lady's way, Terry? And I'm coming to do your weekly love reading for the week of August 28th through September 4th, 2017. The cards I am using today are Oracle of the Mermaid cards by Lucy Cavendish. And I close off with my Miss Cleo cards. I like to read those straight out the book to ensure you get your full message. I want to thank everybody for like, sharing, and subscribing, and setting up personal readings with me. And if you want a personal reading, check in the description box below. Email me, and we can set something up. Other than that, make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs, and let's get this show on the road. Sorry, I've been doing this for a long time. I mean, like hours and hours and hours and hours and days. So I might see stuff twice in the opening okay so let's go out and see Sagittarius 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 what's going on with Sagittarius August 8th August 28th August 28th through September 4th 2017 what's going on in love life of the Sagittarius. Mm. All right, so we are dealing with a arrogant person, somebody who feels like everybody is on their time. So, um, I'm going to say you are the, um, because it's upright. So we're going to say you're being very aggressive to somebody and this situation has been going on for a long time. And I feel like you feel like you can do this because you give this person stuff. So this person may be using you for stuff. So you feel like you can treat them any kind of way, but this is a general read and it can go both ways. All right, so seems like somebody is finally starting get starting to get angry. So you are finally start get starting to get angry about the situation where this person is using you. I mean, you were controlling first, but now you're angry. Oh, so only reason you mad is you found out because they dealing with somebody else. Yeah, so you can give them anything. You know, it's like a. You do what I say, I give you what you want, and we good, you know? And then now you find out that this person got somebody else and you are pissed, okay? Wow. Um, wow. So, you find out that this person, whew, this person really doesn't care for you anymore, sexually. They're not sexually attracted to you. Um... Uh, this could be two things. This could be you guys have a child, but the child isn't yours. Or this could be they really care about the other relationship that they're in. So this probably got something to do with those cards at the beginning where they flipped out like, you leaving me, I don't care. So, I don't know. I feel like this is a humbling event for you. Jesus. I'm, I don't like thunder. <laughs> All right, so let's go, let's go, let's go. What's going on with the Sagittarius? Sagittarius. I don't know if I said this earlier, but I read these straight out the book to ensure you get your full message. All right, so what's going on with the Sagittarius? Sagittarius love reading for the week of 8, 24 through 9, 4, 2017. Mm. So somebody tried the... Uh, uh, battle a uh, battle that they wasn't big enough for. Mm. All right, let's see what's going on. So, 
<clears throat> yeah, I think this goes back to the, the cards that flipped out there at the beginning. It's like the I don't care card. Just like the let it all happen. It's like I'm sick of fighting for this unstable relationship, you know? Like it's unstable now that you bought somebody else in here, you know? So I don't want to deal with it. All right, Sagittarius love reading 828 through 9 for 2017. What's going on? Oh my god. I'm sorry, I'm freaking out over here. I don't know when you're single and you live by yourself with a bunch of dogs and lightning. Mm -mm, I don't like it. All right. Mm hmm. Wow. So, it seems like this person is dealing with one person for love and one person for money. And these are the choices. So, this could be you doing this or this could be your partner doing this. Mm -mm. So, this relationship or situation was slowly happening. It didn't happen like right away. It was like a gradual, gradual situation. Wow. Okay, yes, yeah, so does seem like this person is going to leave you for the third party. Okay? I mean, just by looking at them. And you're trying to stop it from happening. I'm sorry. Oh, so first we got the Queen of Coins here. I'm going to start reading them out the book. Queen of Coins, where are you? Queen. I'm sorry, this thunder got me shook up. All right, so um, a time of economic balance and enjoyment of luxury and comfort, a bright economic outlook. Okay, so that's basically saying money's coming in. So maybe you're starting a new job or something. But I really feel like it was the situation before, but it could be both. All right, so we got the two coins reversed. So this is, this card indicates... Um, emotional intimidation and communication. Be very careful with papers you may sign. Make sure you understand any offers that it, are extended to you. So, I mean, when I'm looking at this, I'm let me just read the coins first. Wow, this I never seen a set of cards that went together so well. I mean, it's not good, but it's just so complete. All right, um, Queen of Cups. It's upright, indicates a person or a situation where devotion and love are present. May indicate um, paranormal abilities. All right, or you may experience those. And then we got the Three of Staffs. And this is reversed. It says, a positive and complete into a issue that plague your emotions. Okay. Yeah, so this if this is job, it's like you got a choice between a job that uh, you love or a job that brings you money, you know? So it seems like uh, if it is, you're going to go for the job you love, but if, which it's a love reading, so it's basically saying... Somebody is making a choice, and the choice is not going to be in your favor. They're choosing the person over love, over the person with the money. It's your reading, so you're going to be the overall. And, and they're going the, they go a third way. You know, and when people, like money and materialistic things, some of these people just use you just to stay at your place. I mean, some even people even use you for just food, you know, relationships for just food. So, it's like, you don't have to have, like, bundles and stacks of money, you know what I'm saying? People will use you for whatever they can get for free. But, that's all I have. Um, make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs. If you want a personal reading, check in the description box below. Email me and we can set something up. Other than that, have a great week.